Welcome back, everyone. Well, welcome back. I just took a big drink of water. <laughs> Jeff is hydrated. Don't worry, guys. Hey, got got to maintain. Yep. You seen that uh, what's the subreddit? Hydro homies. Uh, no. <laughs> Sounds like it's up my alley, though. It is. It's like just people that like mm, water. <laughs> Love water. I think we've talked about this before, but I remember somebody asking a question on Reddit once on if people prefer their water cold or not. And I was confused at the question because I was like, well, obviously, who doesn't like their water cold? But oh my God, were the overwhelming response any normal person drinks it at room temperature? Yeah. Um, I don't think I think America's like this is what I experienced whenever I left the country. No one else has any fucking ice. I mean that <laughs> is that's true or air conditioning. Remember? Yeah. Yeah, they just want to be miserable, I think. That's why the Brits are so angry all the time. They don't got any fucking ice in their drinks. Yeah, I think Orange. it's weird people talk about like the like the fancy German beers and stuff, how you're supposed to drink them warm. And I'm like, this is, that's, it tastes disgusting. Warm yeah, beer in that. itself is just not good. No warm beer, I'm good, thank you. <laughs> okay, how do we... Yeah, I don't like really any, like, room temperature beverage. No, I mean... I can't think of anything I want that's not cold, what, other than coffee. Warm water will quench me if I'm super thirsty and need it, but that's all it's doing is quenching me. It is It is not the, ah, this is delicious. Yeah. Honestly, when I started the subathon last time, and I didn't have the ice maker or anything, uh... That sucked. <laughs> the water just being, you know, room temperature water. I was like, ah, this is awful. And that ice maker was a game changer. That would be your downfall and survivor. Honestly. Like, you're, you're like room temperature water. No thanks. Yeah. I got to go, guys. I'm tapping out. Let's see. Okay, I'm making some progress on this crazy hallway. I'd like to make, like, some traps and, like, capture, like, squirrels and stuff. I think that'd be cool. You, you've you said that numerous times. Like, you really want to get a squirrel. Yeah. Last time I was going to try harder to, like, shoot one, but then chat got really upset about it and was like, well, not really upset, but they were like, I'd prefer it if you didn't. That sounds um, over-the-top insane upset. Yeah, they were, they were irate. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I would prefer if you didn't. Thank you very much. Yeah. Uh, so I ended up not doing it last time, but I think I'll start with like the deadfall trap, and that's something I can work on at night too, like the uh, the like figure four trap stuff. I mean, do you have heavy enough rocks and stuff? I've always been so confused at those, like because I, I understand the concept. It's not a hard concept. It's something heavy on you know something smaller. But mm -hmm. setting one up in such a way that gets that stays up, but has a mouse like be able to trip it. Yeah, I mean, I I I have that survival guide book that has like the diagrams for all the traps and stuff, and it's got a pretty good diagram for how to make the figure four one. And so it's like a hair trigger, like you barely touch it and it falls. But then something about how it, what the hell's the word for that? Um, like the pressure that holds it all together. I don't know. There's a word for tension. Maybe yeah. That's the right word. Uh, like the way the tension works, it just works. Um, but, but I always get confused at those. Like how are they not just blown over in a breeze? Oh, uh, I mean, that does happen. I think sometimes, um, it seems if it's got th find them if it's, like nothing in it. Sure. But if it's got that much of a hair trigger, I mean, that's just, I would think you walk away and then like the ground right. rattling is going to be well, like, yep, there goes your trap. Like it doesn't work. That's what I, that's what I've been more confused about those with. Like, I understand the concept of them. I'm just like, how would that stay? Yeah. Um, this 
Yeah, I don't know how to put a lava here. Oh, there's above me, though. Oh, God, there is above me. Check this there's out. There's a skeleton down here where I get my lava from, and I don't know how the hell anyone could spawn down here. It's nothing but lava. <laughs> Does he spawn, like, over here somewhere, maybe? He's a new type of skeleton. Oh, my God, yeah, this is a whole... This is just a whole place up here. Oh my god, and I have fake lava on me. I'm, I'm so mad. Okay, now I gotta figure out how to. I'm on the out of arrows. Lame. Are we anywhere near one of the new lava lakes? Because I don't remember where they are at. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we are. Um, if you come back, I can show you how to get to them. I'm next to you now. Oh. I was. Then, you walked away. Oh. <laughs> I'm at the front. Oh, I'm at, at the, the back door then. of the house. You're at the lava? Oh. Okay, so it's right down here then. Yeah. I don't want to come this way. Where'd you go? No. Go back to the back of the house. Okay. Oh, it's Creeper. Uh, creeper following you. I don't have any arrows. Jesus, like, I hate, I hate. Um, <laughs> all right, I don't want to go this way. Go down here. This is okay. Lava, lava, lava. lava. This is, like, the most nerve-wracking part. Yeah, need, like, fucking ten buckets or something. Each. Yeah, I made another one at the beginning of this episode just to not have only two. Yeah, I'm running with two right now as well. I need to need to up my game. Yeah, I'm I'm up to three. And I don't know if I came out of there the right way. I did not. I'm by a place I've passed a dozen times and don't remember where it's at in relation to anything else. <laughs> oh, creeper. What is this? Oh, there's the door. Okay. Okay, I'm back. It seems dark where you're at. It's very dark where I'm at. Extremely dark. You like watching the stream? Yeah, I just... Whoa. Okay, where did this that creeper that just tried to kill me even come from? Did I just leave an opening in here? I don't understand how he got into the stairwell. Oh my god, I found a crazy mushroom farm. Oh. Like an insane mushroom farm. You know, I bet with you AFKing today, that's why we have so many mushrooms. I, w I wouldn't think that this would be loaded, though. Oh, well, maybe. Because it's still only going to do that where it's loaded, right? It should, yeah. Um, though, like, remember Spawn was always loaded in this version. Might it still be. So this could be directly under spawn. Right. Okay. I don't know how to... How to get this area under control now. Because I can't just go in and... Hold on. Get light. Okay, some light. Some light. Be light. So, uh, at the end of the last subathon, my Ozempic really wasn't even a thing anymore like i was just hungry all the time um, whereas when i started 
I was like never hungry because they was food just the way it works. Right. Um, and so this time I'm back to where I was again, where like I'm never hungry again. And uh, so then today when I was getting ready to get out there, I forgot to eat. <laughs> and so then I get out there, and I'm like, oh fucking hell. I didn't eat anything. Like, I have to go make some food or something because I don't have any food out here or anything right now. But you, you got an ATV. Go go catch a fish in this fully stocked fish pond that exists. That's true. I could have done that. Okay, I cannot for the life of me tell what's going on. This is a giant room. There are spiders everywhere I can hear. Okay, put some light there. Oh, my God. There, I, there are so many mushrooms. You need to come Wait. see this area. How do I get there? Uh, Can you take me there? Yeah, let me... Uh, 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 Where do you want me to meet you? Back door. Oh, yeah, I thought I was by the back door. Oh, yeah, it's right here. Just be careful. It's still kind of dangerous in parts of it. All right. Up here. And then up this way. And just watch out here. And then over here. Holy shit. And then look up. Oh, my God. <laughs> like I said, they're, they're just, every time I turn, there's just, there's mushrooms everywhere. Yeah, it goes back pretty far over here, too. No, yeah, it's it. wild. It's a lot of mushrooms. That's a little dangerous spot. Let's uh, cover that. Yeah, there's just, there's so many. Is this, let me see where this is at. Uh, It's at 28. So, yeah, that would be spawn chunk, wouldn't it? Probably. Because yeah. they were at zero, zero before, and they go out, I don't know. Yeah. Now we just need more lava. Yeah, I think it's... Things are just spawning up, and that's what keeps getting to me. I keep trying... All the things that were lighting up, though, I try to look up and make sure we're covering that as much as possible, but... It just seems like maybe that's not the case. Bucket too. How many diamonds did we end up with? I think there's nine in the chest. I did make a diamond shovel last time because I was gathering all that gravel. But I think there's still nine more. Still tempted at some point to make a nether run. Just to Yeah, there's nine in there. Just to look around. Oh my god. I opened the door with a bucket and it turned out to be a fake bucket. I don't know if I ever did go to the nether before when I did this. I know I may have done it, like, as I ended or whatever. But I definitely never made it, like, a thing that that's where my lava came from or anything like that. Well, I don't think we're running out of lava anytime soon. So no. I, so I don't feel it's that crazy. But I don't remember what the nether had to offer back. I don't think it had anything to offer. I don't know that it does now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's got nether wards and all that stuff, but it didn't back yeah. then. No, no, it didn't. Um, okay. I mean, there was zombie pigmen. They dropped gold. Cool. Was there... Did they drop gold even back then? Maybe they didn't, actually. I don't know. I thought they did, but that's possible they didn't. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember at all what... Okay, I hear you, skeleton, but I can't see. It was ghasts. Gas tears. There wasn't potions yet, was there? Oh, uh, no, I don't. I doubt it. Oh, that's so, like, good. none of that. That at least lit this up somewhat to take a look around. Is 
I'm up to four lava buckets. Oh. We have 52 iron in there. Okay, that looped around to somewhere I've already been. Okay, that makes me feel better. up here okay I think I've made it to never mind I spoke too soon what are you gonna say I was gonna say I made it to the top of this section so nothing else can drop down on me but in the corner of the darkness there's more it's gonna block it off and come back and get more lava there's just always more A wild cave. Yeah, I mean, you explored it all. Once. Once. I wonder if there was still areas that, like, I just couldn't, you know, like, find or whatever. That you would have had to dig maybe through a wall yeah. that you didn't realize. Yeah. I did. Most likely there was, because it's... This cave is crazy. Yeah, I basically felt done once. I couldn't hear mobs anymore anywhere. I was like, well, the mobs are all gone, so I guess... I guess I'm done here. Yeah, even... The, and you say that, and I walk outside of our door, and I have, like, mm. zombies chasing me. And I feel we've lit up around here a lot. Yeah, that's the frustrating thing, is I keep being like, all right, I'm not going to run to mobs outside the house anymore. And then the moment I leave the house, I'm just like, yeah, how are you? Come on. I bet all of these buckets are fake. All the buckets nope. are fake. Nope, they all seem to be real. Something's burning inside of our house. Oh, I thought you <laughs> meant in real life. And I'm like, you should check on that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I came up and I, I heard fire, but I don't see it, but it's gone. So Sometimes the there's like a chest over in the corner. There's some lava that would catch on. Or not chest, um, workbench. Did that stuff not burn back then? No, I don't think so. Does it burn now? No, I don't remember. No. no. Yeah, how is there well, so... Well, I mean, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> how is there so many zombie sounds by where I'm at? Oh, because there's this giant up path. My God, this is like right outside of our door. I don't think they burn, but they might. I don't think they do. I'm gonna go say I'm gonna say no. Final answer. Okay, here is a zombie. There's a creeper down there too. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of cave like kind of right outside the house that we haven't taken care of yet. How uh, how caught up are you in Survivor? Since you're not going to get caught changed. up anymore. Nothing's changed. Yeah. No, because we started watching Shameless. Um, we got to, like, season three of Shameless. Then we watched um, Them. Have you seen trailers for that or anything? No. Never even heard of it. Uh, do you have Amazon Prime? Of course you do. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I've decided. Uh, you should you should watch a trailer doesn't, for it. Doesn't it have ads now? Um, there's an ad at the start of every episode. Boo. Yeah, it's not great, but it's only like 15 seconds. It's okay. Um, but yeah, you should watch a trailer and see. It's just called Them. Um, it's got two seasons, and season two just came out, I think. Uh, but uh, we uh, we watched that last week, and they were both fantastic, both seasons. It's like, um, it's like a horror genre series sort of thing. Um horror genre series sort of thing like it's uh the the episodes are horror based yeah like you seen like haunting of hill house or haunting a blind man or any of those sort of things on netflix uh, i've seen them on net i've seen that they exist right well it's like those even though you haven't seen those that doesn't really tell you a lot um 
but yeah, it's got the same vibe as like that show. Yeah, Shows but... are also really good. Do you like horror? Not really. It's never been something uh, that I was too entertained by. Like, I've never, I've enjoyed, but I'm not really a fan of the like, the Freddy Kruegers and the Jasons and you know those sort of things. Right. But like the like thriller horror style, I really like. Um, I think of a good example of something like that, like uh, like a lot of Stephen King stuff. Um, I really liked like The Shining, uh, The Stand. So I I appreciated The Shining, but I think like. It's just because it's a classic that you like. You have to watch it at some point, and but it's not my go-to type of film. Like I never was into Stephen King books either, so mm-hmm. things like it and um, what's the other one? Cujo, Pet Cemetery, those I've seen all those, and I'm like, nah, not a big fan. Yeah, huh. this thing's on fire. I'm trying to make sure. Yeah. It is. This thing really wants to be on fire. Yeah, well, you might not like them then, uh, since you're not really that big. Of a <laughs> but, I uh, might not like them then, then, them. <laughs> uh, but I really liked it. There are zombies everywhere outside of our house right now. Come on, what is happening? There's this guy trampling our crops. Guy on the other side, probably trying to trample our crops. I mean, we must be doing a good job of lighting up the rest of the cave because I feel like they're spawning even more right on these yeah. less lit up areas around our house. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Um, I also agree we're out of time, unfortunately. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll All see right. you next time. We'll see you next time.